ANC Secretary General Figile Mbalula says the late Free State Education MEC Tate Mahwe almost became a victim of the ANC's factional battles. Mahwe was sidelined in the ANC's provincial conference in January when he was not voted into the provincial executive committee. Mbalula says the ANC was in the process to co opt Mahwe into the PEC. Speaker after speaker described Mahwe as an exemplary man and the epitome of excellence who advocated for quality education. He was laid to rest in Bloemfontein today. Mahwe died together with his protector last week, Sunday, after the vehicle they were traveling in drove into two cars on the N1 near Winburg. Tate Mahwe's comrades commended his dedication and commitment to serve. Mbalula says it would have been a loss for the Free State to lose a man of Mahwe's caliber in government. Tate Mahwe was one of our best. And he didn't have to prove himself. It should be natural among us that we can never put this man in the streets. I came here in the first state, I met with comrades. Mahwe was known for his humility and integrity. Mona's who gathered to bid him farewell say he was an epitome of hard work. So we need to carry his teachings and the lessons that he taught, he taught us, you know, and like throughout our lives. I hope he knows that I will continue fighting to eradicate poverty, to educate the youth, and to advance South Africa the way he wanted me to. Those who were close to him say government should ensure that Mahwe's legacy should continue. A man who had, who had so much potential, so many things still to give to society, to the community, to his family. But God had other plans. Mahwe is the longest serving member of legislature since 1994. He has served in various portfolios including MEC for Agriculture, Finance, Public Safety. In May 2009, he was appointed as MEC for Education. Under his watch, Free State attained the highest metric pass rate in the country for four consecutive years from 2019. As an engineering graduate, science and maths were close to his heart. Thank you for giving him to the people to be their servant till his last day. We pray that you find peace and comfort. He's at a better place where there is no pain, no sorrow. He played his part, finished his assignment on earth, let him go and rest in peace as he put his pen down. As we bid farewell to Dede Tate Mapwe, Chair, we do so with heavy hearts, but at the same time, with a great sense of gratitude for the time we shared with him. We take great comfort in knowledge that, we will be rem that he will be remembered as a true champion of basic education and a servant of people. Mahwe has been laid to rest in Bloemfontein. He is survived by his wife Ivy and children. Apumelele Mkalane, SABC News, Bloemfontein.